I'm Chad Cundiff, Vice President of Career Interface Products, and this is our approach from the research we did with Project Sandblaster. Here you can see we're on approach right now uh, into a landing area. So we've got the landing area programmed, our helo is moving in, uh, we've got some fixed waypoints in the sky that we're, we're flying through that, that guide us uh, our flight path into the landing area. Now we're starting our deceleration into the landing area, and that's enunciated right there on the screen. And now as we come in a little closer to the landing area and we start our deceleration, uh, this right now is, is the synthetic view. So this is all database-driven symbology uh, showing the terrain. Now as we move in closer here, what's going to happen is our sensors are going to start to sweep this area. Um, so we, we have a, a millimeter wave, LiDAR sensors, whatever we have on board the helicopter at this point starts to sweep this area. And now we'll get a real-time information about what kind of obstacles are in there. So if we have men or equipment, if the area has been changed because of uh, impacts, temporary buildings, whatever, uh, the radar entry now comes in and now takes a look. The other thing that's happening here is we're now going into sort of a wingman view of the helicopter so that we can look ahead of ourselves a little bit um, and see where we're going to touch down and see how it's going to look as we come into the landing area. Now you can see the area is coming out. We're seeing more refined symbology uh, in terms of what types of obstacles are in the area, blocks, buildings, bumps, those type of things. Now we've selected our landing zone. Uh, so now as we select our landing zone, again, remember that we're in a wingman view, so we're actually right over that. The yellow circle there is showing us uh, where we're going to actually, where we're at, and the blue cyan circle showing us where we're going to touch down. Now as we overlay those two, uh, now we start to go ahead and move into the touchdown maneuver. And voila, here we are, safe and sound in our landing zone.